What's going on everyone? Uh, this is gonna be a short video uh, to answer a question that I was I was actually looking for this answer and I didn't want to put money into finding the answer um, and I couldn't find the answer so I'm like you know what let's find the answer and the answer is to the question will your classic iPod first gen or second gen the old brick style ones with the actual like physical wheel that moved which is the first one and the second gen where it's uh, it, it, it's stationary, it does not move, but it still, it still clicks with the buttons. This guy here, this is the second gen, 20 gig, right? Will this work with a modern day Mac? Um, it would have worked with Windows. Uh, Windows discontinued uh, support for it, I believe after Windows XP. And I wasn't about to try to, you know, run a virtual box with XP and jump through a bunch of hoops and do that to try that out. Anyway, um, I'm like, maybe I'll just buy a cable for it, right? I already had the original FireWire, a couple of them laying around. This is from like my EyeSight camera there. This is the original OEM FireWire to like FireWire, traditional FireWire, all right? And then we need to convert it to like the new small, like the six pin or nine pin, whatever the hell it is. This one here, convert there. I got this from Valley Village for like $5, right? Anyway, I'm like, okay, well, let's see if it works, right? So let me just fire up my MacBook there. You can see I got my Mac working right there. So what we're going to do is, I don't know if I can single hand this, but we're going to just plug that in. As you can see, plugged in. And there we go. Let's give it a sec. I believe I had the option for uh, iTunes to like, you know, pop up. Um, there we go. See, popped up automatically. Let's go over here. Focus in on that. Look, there we go. There is the iPod still working. It's got the Firewire logo up there. 20 gigs. Kind of weird when you think about it, right? Let's just go over here and just to show you, like, you know, sync, sync is complete, done, right? So we'll jump back over here. Actually, let's eject this first. Let's go eject. That's ejected. Okay, disconnect. Okay, disconnect. Single hand that guy off. Give it a sec. restarting itself there we go of course because it's my new Mac I only have like a CD on it um, we got Astro World I got Astro World on the second gen um, iPod there the big old brick so uh, the answer to the question is will a classic Original release iPod work on a current day Mac? Yes, it will. Windows? No, not unless you have XP and FireWire port. But using an adapter and using, um, you know, a Mac today, uh, which is, you know, 2018, this does work. So um, I hope this answered the question for some of you out there. I hope you enjoyed the video. Any other questions, let me know. Leave them down below. We'll try some maybe, uh, you know, see if this works. Anything else works, old tech, whatnot. Uh, and we'll uh, we'll leave there. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.